10 Discontinued Candies If you're a teenager or a young adult, you might remember that some of your favorite candies from your childhood simply seemed to vanish out of thin air and never appeared once more at the grocery store or at your local candy shop. What could have happened to them? And why were they discontinued? Welcome to Film Jumbo, and today we'll be featuring our top 10 discontinued candies video, where we will present you with some of the most beloved candies that were discontinued for whatever reason by their manufacturer. Stay until the end to find out which candy was the most popular, yet also discontinued for the dumbest reason ever. Also, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for more amazing video content like today. So let's begin with 10th place. Tenth place, PB Max. The tenth spot on our list is the PB Max. Who doesn't remember the tasty peanut butter cream mixture with the milk chocolate of the PB Max? The PB Max was made in the US by Mars, and it was first released in 1990. How can you not remember it with the commercials that were released? Early television commercials for PB Max declared that the PB in its name didn't stand for things such as Piggy Banks, Polka Band, Portly Ballerina, Platinum Blonde, Penguin Black Belt, Pig Basketball, Plow Boy, Pure Bliss, Parachuting Buffalo, or Pink Baboon, and that it, in fact, stood for peanut butter. According to former Mars executive Alfred Poe, PB Max was discontinued due to the Mars family's distaste for peanut butter, despite $50 million in sales. Ask us if that makes any sense afterwards. Ninth place, Hershey's Swoops. In the ninth place on our list, we have Hershey's Swoops. If you know Pringles, you probably also remember the Swoops, as they look just like them, but bathed in chocolate by the Hershey's Company. They were produced in the following flavors, Hershey's Milk Chocolate, Reese's Peanut Butter, Almond Joy, York Peppermint Patty, White Chocolate Reese's, and Toffee and Almond. Limited edition varieties include the White Chocolate Peppermint, available around Christmas, Special Dark with Almonds, and Strawberries and Cream. Despite all these various flavors, they were introduced into the market in 2003 and discontinued in August of 2006. It seems like only 14% of customers actually knew about their existence. So unlike PB Max, swoops were not very lucrative for the Hershey's company. Eighth place, Hershey's Kissables. In the eighth place on our list, we have Hershey's Kissables. These candy-coated treats were sort of like a big misshapen M&M, chocolatey but with a bit of crunch. They were discontinued a few years ago, probably because they became less palatable when Hershey's tried to save money by swapping out the cocoa butter for cheaper fats. In mid-2007, Hershey's introduced a dark chocolate version called Kissables Dark, which featured more subdued colors and a semi-sweet interior. Hershey's ceased producing the Kissables in July 2009. Seventh place, candy cigarettes. Coming in in the seventh place on our list, we have candy cigarettes. Who doesn't remember feeling like the coolest kid on the block when puffing out a cloud of sugar from one of these cigarettes? Candy cigarettes were made out of chalky sugar, bubblegum, or chocolate wrapped in paper and packaged and branded to resemble cigarettes. Some products contain powdered sugar hidden in the wrapper, allowing the user to blow into the cigarette and produce a cloud of sugar that imitates smoke, which comes out of the other end. However, they were discontinued because they were widely believed to cause actual smoking later in life when used by kids. They even performed a study to prove this hypothesis. A 1990 study found that 6th graders who used candy cigarettes were twice as likely to smoke cigarettes than those who did not use candy cigarettes. A 2007 study surveyed 25,887 adults and found that candy cigarette use was reported by 88% of both current and former smokers and 78% of never smokers. So maybe this one had a reason for why they were discontinued, unlike our previous entries. Sixth place, Lollipipes. Moving on to the sixth place on our list, we have lollipipes. You can definitely expect that if candy cigarettes were discontinued for a valid reason, then their close cousin, lollipipes, were probably on the way to the same fate. 
This piece of candy, much in the same vein as the classic candy cigarettes, seemed to send the message that pipes are cool, particularly those that are used to smoke marijuana or other more illicit drugs. The best part of the lollipipes is that they were flame-proof, or so they said to be. Who knows? We can't find out, as they are discontinued already. Fifth place, Tastations. In the fifth place on our list, we have Tastations. They were one of Hershey's first introductions to hard candy, and came in multiple flavors. While the few fans out there still mourn this loss, there's surprisingly not too much information out there as to why Hershey's let these candies go. We only have our memories to fondly remember their gloriously sweet taste. Fourth place, Hershey's Bites. Coming in at our fourth place, we have the fondly remembered Hershey's Bites. These ones came in many different flavors, and their appeal was in their bite-sized shape, which made them easy to eat and enjoy without having to down a whole candy bar. However, their doom also came due to the same fact. Hershey's Bites were reportedly yanked from the candy lineup due to them being a choking hazard. Now that we've arrived at the top three, get ready to find out which ones are the most beloved yet discontinued candies in the world. Third place, Jumbo Nerds. In the third place on our list, we have Jumbo Nerds. Jumbo Nerds was a box of nerds with multiple flavors, much larger than regular nerds. We all remember that iconic box depicting one jumbo nerd on one end of a seesaw with several regular sized nerds trying to counter its weight. However, the problem with jumbo nerds was that the smaller sized ones were simply better. They were lighter, easier to carry around, and the big ones were a bit uncomfortable in our mouths when we already had tried the smaller ones. In this case, eh, bigger is not always better, which is the reason why jumbo nerds ended up discontinued from the shopping aisles. Second place, Lifesavers Holes. In the second place on our list, we have Lifesavers Holes. Lifesavers are manufactured by creating solid disc-shaped candies and then cutting out the center holes. The reason why the Lifesavers Holes were discontinued was actually in the manufacturing process. Cutting the holes manually was very expensive, very tedious, and the hole sales were not enough to justify the process, so they had to be stopped. Still, we can't hope but that someday, these fresh sweet mints will come back to our grocery store. First place, Hershey's S'mores. Winning the gold medal for the most beloved discontinued candy in our list are the Hershey's S'mores. Hershey's S'mores was a candy bar made by the Hershey's Company and introduced on January 1st, 2003. The bar consisted of a layer of graham cracker bits topped with marshmallow and coated with milk chocolate, though it was finally, and sadly, discontinued by Hershey's in 2012. While we can attempt to recreate them by actually creating s'mores in our campfires using marshmallows and chocolate, it will never be the same as the time when we had the s'mores bar. Those were definitely some of the tastiest candies ever, yet we're unable to find them anymore. Their taste will remain in our memory, at least. Anyway, which of these do you remember fondly? Let us know in the comments. Also, don't forget to leave us a like if you enjoyed the video, share it with your friends, and subscribe to Film Jumbo to keep receiving more incredible content like today's video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.